What are some things that can happen to you when you're on the cleanse that people call up about? Because we already talked about people throwing up. We talked about people having migraines. What are some Headaches. other side effects that could happen? Okay. You want me to talk about the good ones or the bad ones? Both. Okay. So so the good ones that we kind of already mentioned, more energy. Mm-hmm. So you're going to feel like you're 12 years old all over again. Um, you're talking about um, uh, being able to focus and concentrate a lot better. Uh, a huge, uh, clearer skin. Um it's a lot of wonderful things. Now, as far as some of the things that are people consider bad is throwing up is probably the worst one. Mm-hmm. But like I said, it's not necessarily a bad Sweating thing. Sweating a lot. So that don't mean Sweating. your body's rejecting something? Mm-hmm. Nah, not. I think it's your body is now realizing that it's about to get all this mucus out of its system. Mm-hmm. And that's just one way of doing it. I looked at it like it was a detox, like when people. What are you doing, Envy? I, don't know what's I, looked, at, I looked at it like it. Jesus Christ, Envy. Envy, what is <laughs> wrong stop. with you? Ah, there we go. It wouldn't stop. I look at it like it's a real detox, <laughs> like when people are on drugs and they have to go to the hospital and get things out of their body that aren't good for them, and then they start throwing up and, and having shaking. the chills mm-hmm. and shaking. I didn't know if it was a similar thing. Mm, it, it can be similar for some certain people. I have never had that personal experience. I've definitely heard of people having those experiences. Mm-hmm. Like I said, we tailor down the capsules. We get you on the right path. And it has to do with your history. What about discharge? That was one thing they told me could potentially happen. They were For like, sure. you might have some greenish discharge. With it. At your butt? <laughs> no. Oh. <laughs> it's possible. <laughs> it's possible because you got to remember, Scott, women have that sixth <laughs> channel of elimination, which is the vagina. So, therefore, you can have discharge. But that's the, also the reason why women live longer than men because you do have that sixth channel. Mm-hmm. Bad breath. Can happen. I had bad breath for three days last week. Well, you had that, you had that anyway. <laughs> Shut up. Well, I know somebody that's been detoxing for a long time. <laughs> <laughs> you're also not supposed to have sex, right, when no you're sex. doing a detox? Well, you're, that's the exchange of fluids. Mm-hmm. So that's what that's about. Yeah. What do you mean? Like you can't, your fluids are well, toxic or something? Well, that person's not cleansing. Okay. Unless that person, well, you got to oh, remember. Oh, so I don't want someone's nasty meat toxins in me or something? No, you got to remember. So when you are cleansing, <laughs> <laughs> when you are cleansing, all the bad stuff is trying to get out. It's mm-hmm. going to get out of every orifice on your body, and having sex is one of them. Okay. Mm. How, to think what else How important is it to, to adhere to that part? Huh? How important? Barry, is I didn't have it? sex. Do your for, best, Angela. No, I, I didn't have sex for <laughs> uh, if mine. I didn't have sex for seven days. I was scared that I was going to release toxins. You know what I'm going to you? I was talking to the cameraman <laughs> earlier. Cold showers. Okay. Are cold showers important? Cold shower. I'm going to tell you the truth. Well, you're not having sex, so. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. Cold shower, you talking about like closing your pores and things like that? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> yeah. Uh, on the cleanse, it's not, it's not something that we bring up the importance of. 